you have to say the name to the blog. My different one. But it was this blanket amazing. is the best blanket I've ever used <laughs> in my <laughs> entire life. Hmm. It's massive. Um, it feels like you're being hugged by a miniature bear. <laughs> Sick <'em. laughs> Like, not too much weight, but it's still, like, big. Yeah, we feel good about you know? the mm-hmm. trailer. It's great. Ah! No, I want one. Okay. I'm glad we're in the truck and not I was just hand. inquiring about uh, where they purchased this. Yeah. <laughs> Tyler and Maddie made us tacos. <laughs> breakfast tacos. For breakfast. <laughs> and they're very good. And they made John a smoothie, and I got to have some of it. It's really yummy. What team is this? Oh, that's the school I teach at, Geyer High School. Oh my gosh. Go Wildcats. <laughs> I thought it was like a football team, like NFL. They are a football team, but not NFL. <laughs> but not NFL at all. Oh my gosh. Sports. What a couple games this year. This is them all together. The fam. The boss fam. Hello. Uh, Can you give him a smile? Can you smile? The smile. The smile. We're gonna be. Oh, uh, there's uh, the smile. Little. Uh, uh, about it. Mm-hmm. And the pterodactyl scream. So. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> it's her way of singing. I think she wants to be a medicine man. Oh yeah. What a pretty what? shirt. Thanks. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Get it, Peter. So. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that. So. The businessman. I'll have my people talk to other people. Who's that? That was our agent in Los Angeles. So who was it really? California. So who actually was it? Uh, Beyonce. Mm-hmm. So who actually was it? Well, Beyonce is our agent. <laughs> Does that make sense? Because we're both fans. She booked she this tour. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Good morning, vlog. I have a friend with me. This is Penelope. Say hi. Oh. Wow. Wait. 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 <laughs> this is Penelope. This is Tyler and Maddie's daughter. And she's so cute. And we're hanging while her. Daddy and Mama eat. It's so pretty. Ah. I didn't sleep so well, but everyone else slept really well. So maybe I'll just fall asleep in the car or something. I do this thing where I'll wake up at like five. Like last night, I woke up at five and I couldn't go to sleep until seven thirty this morning. So, and then I fell asleep again. It was weird. We went to bed at like midnight, and then yeah, that happened. So. But we're excited. We're going to Stillwater today. We're playing at the Iron Monk Brewing Company. Um, so we're really excited. I've actually never been to Stillwater. So I'm excited to see the thing. How many times can I say excited? There's exploding kittens. I've never played it, but the photos are not good. Wait, yeah. show them a PG one. Yo, I want to see a funny cat. Yeah. Um, I don't want to see His name is Bikini yeah. Cat. Like Brazilian. <laughs> oh hey, didn't see you there. I'm Heather. Welcome to my crib. This is my bed. This is how I get to it. See, it's all nice and laid out. I've got a pillow. Oh yeah. This is me on my bed. This is what I look like on my bed. Water. Some, some, ja- some jackets for blankets if I get cold. Um, I've got my friend. What more could you could you need in the in the crib? Hashtag crib nation. Hashtag crib central. <laughs> actually want to know something? What? Me and my friends uh, used to put honey mustard on these and eat them. Ew! It's good. Sean, what are you doing? I'm getting some trail 
trail mix for myself because it's just a handy treat to have like <laughs> on the go and you yeah. can have it whenever you want and stuff. It's a lot. <laughs> I'm not done yet. <laughs> you had one job. And what was your job? It was to get sandwich materials with Steven. Okay. So I took that as I guess Steven could just get the sandwich parts. <laughs> and you'll just get trail mix. Oh my gosh. No, this is where it's at. I got some pork rinds. Wait, what's where it's at? You just ate. I'm telling Winco. Winco. <laughs> I just ate that. Oh, it's so good. It's like chocolate. Mmm, I love it. Maybe that's not that bad, actually. <laughs> Thank you, Oklahoma! That was a close call. You saw that. It was a close fight. It was a close fight. It's really that kind of fight, you know? Spread my mayonnaise. Mm. <laughs> Yum. <Yeah. so> <laughs> Are you done with this? Go out in the world and spread your mayonnaise. Oh, God. <laughs> no. We're about 100 miles up from Oklahoma <laughs> City. We got stuck at the gosh darn border between Texas and Oklahoma. <laughs> we really did. There were all kinds of people getting pulled over, doing illegal things that we didn't do. Yeah. There was a good border patrol going on. There was nothing you could do except run away and just hope that nobody got hurt. But listen, always do the right thing. <laughs> always eat the white berries. Never eat moldy fruit. In the ways us down The child she wears envelops all our crowns We still forsake all of the joy we found Set aside your heavy load Okay guys, so we are going to Bentonville, Arkansas tonight from Stillwater, Oklahoma. It's like three hours away. It's so far away, but it's okay. Well, we'll get there at some, some time. So some of us have divided and gone into Jack in the Box, whereas some of us have decided to make sandwiches out in a parking lot at nighttime on the ground. Oh yeah, and John is vegan, so it's just mustard. That's the mustard sandwich. It's on the menu. It's what's for dinner. <laughs> Look at my sunburn. Heather tanned in the bed of the truck. No, I while just... While we were driving I from wanted Texas this, to Oklahoma. I wanted to sit back there, and it was sunny and hot today, so I got burned. But I didn't do that so that I could tan. Luke. It wasn't intentional. Get mustard on you. <laughs> Let me just say. Come here. Today was the most insane experience because I've had stressful shows that didn't go well. Oh, I didn't tell them this, about this. 
was so epically stressful and then it went well. Yeah, the stressful part. Our I told soundboard, them that it was great. this is our second show on tour and our soundboard just stopped working. It well it didn't like completely stop working. It started like making this fuzzy sound. And we troubleshot it for like forty minutes before the show started. And we couldn't figure out what the issue was. We tried everything I could think of and we were still having the same issue. And then somebody was like, wait, there's a small soundboard in this closet over here. It only had like eight channels. Normally we use 22. Yeah. John so we were like, all right, what do we not need to mic? So we just had like completely new on the spot arrangements of stuff because we couldn't plug instruments in. And we had like seven minutes to completely incorporate this other soundboard into our setup. So we had a lot of microphones with no cables plugged into them because we had set up everything for our soundboard and we just played it and it was awesome. And the energy was good and it was fun. Yeah. Our harmonies were really tight and the instruments were all... It went well. And together. It was fun. And it could have been terrible. We could have just like... I, I was sitting there thinking, we're not even going to be able to play this gig. It was about to start. I was like, we're just going to have to tell the bartender we're moving on. Yeah. I thought we were just going to be like on our way to Guitar Center to get a new board. <laughs> which we might be tomorrow. We'll find out. Yeah. We'll see. It's a new board, so I'm sure that it's user error. I hope. I'm kind of slow, <laughs> so it's probably my fault. Well, I'm worried because you know that board pretty well. <laughs> so I'm like... Alright, oh. It's locked. <laughs> He's just waving. Awesome. Cool. Yeah, I'll just be out here. I'll just be out here, don't worry. Yeah, so it's gonna be a long night of traveling. We're, we'll probably get to Bentonville around like 2 a.m. But we don't have to do anything tomorrow We I'm, until our show in Fort Smith, Arkansas. So we can sleep in. Um, we're staying with a percussion grad student that just graduated from Baylor. Um, Caleb is his name and his family lives there. And they're very nice. They why well, I haven't met them, but they're, they've been very nice to us and are letting them, letting us stay with them. And they have a pool, so they were like, you can use our pool. So that's what we're going to do tomorrow and just chill. Believe it or not, day two, but like, we're pretty tired. So pray for us, um, for energy. Okay, bye. I had so much to say and not, not enough time, time to say it. Nobody even knows my name, I'm sick and tired